name is Dump Truck and welcome to Brown Foreman's House of Whiskey. Now we've got four different brands we're featuring tonight. One being Old Forester, another being Woodford Reserve. We've got three things from Lynchburg, Tennessee. Two you can drink, one you can meet. We have Jack Daniel Single Barrel. We also have Gentleman Jack behind the bar. And from Lynchburg, Tennessee, we brought our assistant master distiller. And you're gonna have some great local flavored live music. Outside, we also have more live music of the bluegrass flavor. And we have a beignet stand, a ping pong table, and cornhole. If you can't have a good time tonight, you're doing it wrong. Events like uh, the Brown Foreman House of Whiskey gives us a great opportunity to engage with our consumers and educate them, not just about Gentleman Jack and Single Barrel, but to give them the Jack Daniels stories. We're here at the Brown Foreman House of Whiskey, and it's a great opportunity for us to talk about Old Forester, which is our company's founding brand. Old Forester is the only brand that's uh, in current production that was in existence before, during, and after Prohibition. So it has a long, long line of tradition, and it's just a phenomenal bourbon. This evening I had Gentleman Jack as my cocktail inspiration. I looked at the Nez Perce Indians who made a maple and maize syrup. They would take corn, reduce that down to a corn syrup, and add just a little bit of maple sap. Gentleman Jack is two times charcoal mellowed with the lemon juice, with Gentleman Jack, with the syrup, great whiskey sour. Top it off with a little bit of chicory uh, pecan bitters and a little bit of toasted pecans. The history of Woodford Reserve goes back to Elijah Pepper in 1812. 2012 celebrated the 200th anniversary at the distillery. It's a one-of-a-kind whiskey made very specially and that's the Woodford way. What we have here are a couple of samples of Jack Daniels Tennessee whiskey. The sample you see with the white label is clear 140 proof whiskey straight off of the still at Jack Daniels. This would be considered a bourbon whiskey. The sample in the black label is actually Jack Daniels Tennessee whiskey after it's been mellowed through our charcoal. The charcoal doesn't add anything. It doesn't impart any color. It doesn't add any flavor. It actually filters out. It removes some of the heavy grainy flavors that come from the raw materials that go into making whiskey. It allows that natural, sweet, fruity Jack Daniels flavor to start coming through. That's what makes Jack Daniels Tennessee whiskey. Good evening, we're making an Old Forester RX. So this is the prescription for what ails you. We use an ounce and a half of Old Forester. And equal parts of a shrub. A shrub is a drinking vinegar uh, created in the 1820s by mistake in New York City. Actually, it was a pickled beet juice plus a little bit of sugar, but we've done an apple butter plus a cider vinegar. We're gonna do equal parts to the whiskey, so one and a half ounces. And we're gonna put some fresh soda on there. Paper straw and some fresh mint. An apple a day will keep the doctor away. Hope to see you next time at the Brown Foreman House of Whiskey.